Good morning, fellow gardeners. This is Paul, and you're looking at Orahona. It's one of the largest flowers of the varieties that I have that have flowered so far. And this one's very, very fragrant and beautiful, as you can see. Now, I cross-pollinated it last night with Paul Thompson's number seven pollen, which I had in the refrigerator. And then we had thunderstorms last night, which is pretty uncommon here in Southern California. So I actually pollinated it again this morning. So hopefully it will set fruit. Now these cuttings produced several flower buds last season. So I just left this one on, even though it's not a very large plant, and we'll see what happens. And I collected a whole lot of pollen from this flower last night. So Orahona. Now let me go show you what other fruit we've had set this season so far. Okay, so here's Bruni and three of the four flower buds opened up. This one got damaged, you can see here. So it aborted, but I have three fruit, which set. And the top two, I used Arizona purple pollen. And this bottom one, I used Paul Thompson's number seven. And you can see that they set fruit because it dries up and stops here and is green. And it's been about a week, maybe another eight days, I think. And so look at that. So I'll get to have three Bruni fruit if all goes well. And let me go show you what happened with those cuttings that produce flowers as well. Okay, so here is that Arizona purple. And it did accept its own pollen and set fruit. So another characteristic very similar to Sugar Dragon. In fact, it looks a lot like Sugar Dragon. I think it is Sugar Dragon. Arizona purple, Sugar Dragon, same thing in my opinion. We'll see. And then this is Paul Thompson's number seven, which is definitely gonna abort, but it's on there really well, but it's turning red. But that was great to get that pollen. And then here is an Ocamponis. And it accepted Bruni pollen. It's looking good right now. But we'll see, because it's on a cutting. So I'm just gonna let it be. So there you go, that's an update on some of the flowers we've had this season on these young plants. All right, give us a like and a subscribe. Thanks for your time. Have a great day. Take care.